right hey everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm here with a box and yes this is my new toddler i'm so excited she just got here today and i'm so excited she got here like around um 10 30 this morning but i wasn't home to get her but we seriously just got home and i'm so excited to open her so this is a custom toddler that I got. Um, I ordered her back in like either, I think it was like March or April. Um, like end of March, beginning of April, I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't exactly remember, but I've been waiting for her for a couple months and I'm so, so excited. Um, her pictures turned out so cute. I can't wait to see her in person. And this is a kit that I've loved for a really long time. I have not revealed anything about the baby except that she's a girl. Um, and that she's a toddler, so that's the only thing anyone knows about her. But, yeah, I'm so excited. Okay. I'm so excited. Okay, this is Kelly. This cute little card. The box smells so good. Oh, look, little socks. All right, I don't know if I can read it yet. Okay, hi Kelly, hope you enjoy her as much as I enjoyed creating her for you. And that's from her artist. I'm not gonna see her artist name just yet. Actually, you're about to see it anyways. Um, okay, this is the care instructions. I have had babies from this artist before. So she is from Mia Maria's nursery of Sarah Corstange. So she's my third baby from Sarah. Sarah has made Laura and Lane. Um, so she's made all my toddlers. I love her for toddlers, like she, I love her bigger dolls, so I'm so excited. So this is just, I have this from when I got Laura and Lance. So I already have two of these care instruction sheets. I'm so excited to see her. Sarah always does such a nice job, especially like even with the box openings and just like everything. They just, oh, it's so cute. Okay, so right here is some diapers. Oh, there's a lot of diapers. Okay, oh, this is so cute. I think this will look really cute on Lane. Um, it has a bunch of astronauts and like space themed things. This is so cute. I've never seen this one. And this one's like really summery with like fruits, like watermelons, kiwis. So cute. Oh, and here's another one. <gasps> Bunnies, that's really cute. I've never seen these patterns before. These are honest diapers. And there's another one. This one has feathers. I have seen this one before. I think, oh wait, no. I've been, I can't talk. I think that was the last one. Okay, so here's a little outfit. Here, I'm gonna push her aside for a second. Okay. Oh, I love this. This is a, oh, she had pictures in this. This is a really cute um, sweater. It's like dark gray and it has some little sparkly gold hearts and a bunch of pink hearts. This is a sweater and it goes over this really cute little kitty dress. I love like cats and like mouse things for my baby. So this is really cute. And the cat has a sparkly gold nose and it's like sleeping. This is really cute. And I think this is 12 months, right? Yeah. So I think she's a little smaller than what I was expecting because I thought she wore 18 months, but I guess I was wrong. <laughs> but Sarah did tell me she wears 12 months. So I think I have to find her some 12 month clothes. But we'll see if she can wear any of Laura's. Okay. Oh, I've seen this on online. It's a swan dress it has a little it has bloomers <clears throat> sorry the other dress has a built-in like it's like a onesie kind of but then this one is like an actual dress and has bloomers and it has a swan with a bunch of sparkly gold like hearts and the sparkly crown sarah always picks out the cutest clothes oh, they're so cute okay and we have this one. Oh, i think i know which this one is Yeah, she sent a ton of pictures in this one, and I love this one. It has a unicorn on it. It's a romper with um, little oval polka dots, and then there's a cute little unicorn with a crown coming out of the corner. This is so cute. These have all been 12 months. And then she said she sent one 18-month outfit, so I think that would probably be this one. So hopefully it fits her, but if not, Laura can wear it. This looks really cute. Yeah, so this is 18 months. Oh, I like that. Every day is magical with mommy. <laughs> That's really cute. And this is like a bunch of different colors. That's embroidered. And then the other onesie has a unicorn. It says small and unique. 
even though she's definitely not small, she's big, because <laughs> she's a toddler. And then oh, the pants, I have not seen this outfit set. This is so cute, there's little flowers all over it and there's a giant unicorn on the back. I've never seen the embroidered like, or not embroidered, the like applique on the side like that. Usually it's just right here. So that's really cool. These are so, so cute. These will definitely be nice for her to wear when it's a little colder out. <laughs> okay, and then I think, yeah, the last thing left is her. Oh wait, I was wrong. There's a little thing right here with some headbands in it. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is a really cute little gift bag. So it has some elephant socks. These are really cute. They're just white or like cream, but then there's a little tiny elephant. That's so, so cute. Oh, and she has a honey bug pacifier. Cause she can take a magnetic one and I'm pretty sure she can also take a cut pacifier. Oh, this one's really pretty. It's like a pearly, like beige. So this will match like a lot of things. It's really cute. And then, and these are really cute little bags. She has little bracelets. <gasps> That's so cute. Two little bracelets. This one's like blue and white and this one is yellow and white. These are really cute. They look so little. <laughs> I'm sure they'll fit her though because they can stretch. And then a little green headband and a gray one. These are so small because they're like toddler headbands. And then, oh, there's something under her butt. <laughs> oh, that's why the box smells so good. It smells like flower baby powder, like not like flower, like the food, but like flowers. This smells really good. It's like lavender, I think. Does it say what scent this is? This smells really good. Soft petals. It smells so good. I really like that. Cause it smells different than like the typical baby powder. I think that smells nicer. I like that. Okay. She's huge, you guys. <laughs> Okay, whoa. So, she has standing legs and that's what I'm so excited for because I've never had a baby with standing legs before. How am I gonna take off, I wanna take off her outfit so I can see it, her legs and stuff. I wanna be able to look at her. I love that diaper, that's really cute. Oh, she's beautiful. She's so cute. Her skin tone is really nice. Laura and Lynn, I think, are a little paler than she is. I really like her coloring. <gasps> wow. Oh, her modeling is so pretty. She's so beautiful. <gasps> How can I get her other leg out? I wanna look at them both. Oh, it's gonna be hard, cause like, usually you have to take the arms out first. Especially with standing legs, it's gonna be hard. Okay, Um. well I saw one of her legs. That's so, so pretty. <gasps> I will get close-ups after, <laughs> definitely. Okay, oh, her body's like, it's like a weird material. I've never felt like a reborn body like that before. It's interesting. All right, let's take off. I know, we're just completely undressing her. This is a really cute sleeper though. Is this Carter's? It is. Oh, it's so cute. She's definitely wearing this tonight. It's like lightweight and it's just like really nice. Oh, this is so cute. Here, we'll zip that up. Look, that's adorable. And that's 12 months. That's so cute. Okay. <gasps> wow, now I can wear her other leg. So pretty. Guys, seriously, Sarah does such a nice job. Like, they may take a little while to make, but they're so worth the wait. She's so pretty. <gasps> wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love these little hands. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh. And she can like sit up and she's able to stand too. We'll test out her standing in a minute. I wanna take off this and look at her face. Okay. And she has a little blanket around her head. Okay, and a diaper. I like these diapers. I don't think these ones are honest, but they're really cute. Little ice cream that's so summery and fun. Here, I'm gonna close this so you can save it. I always save all my diapers. Cause they don't do anything to them, so they can just reuse them. Okay, are we ready? Hold on, I'm gonna bring you guys down. Okay, three, two, one. <gasps> oh, look! <gasps> wow. 
She's got long hair. Her eyes are so big. Oh my goodness. <laughs> her hair is in two little pigtails. I think that was just so she could travel easier, but it's so cute. We're gonna take it out. I wanna take her hair out and look at it. Wow, so she's rooted with um, brown human hair. It feels really real. And it moves, I think it moves pretty realistically. Wow. My other babies all have mohair. This is my first doll with human hair. I used to think it was kind of creepy, but like, um, it's really not like creepy to use human hair. Wow, she's so cute. So this is the Tippy by Linda Murray. I think that's how you say her name. She's so cute. Her eyes are so pretty. They're like a hazel, or not like hazel, but like greenish blue. And um, they're like blue on the edges and green on the inside. Her eyelashes are so cute. Look at that hair. She has bangs. Her hair is so pretty. So I know uh, she was supposed to come, I told you guys she was coming last week, um, but it was taking Sarah a little longer to root the hair than she had expected and because she has such a big head and it was definitely worth the wait. I don't I don't mind waiting at all because like she turned out beautiful. She's so, so cute. Look at her hair. Her hair is longer than Laura's. I wanted her hair to be a little longer so I could do more styles with it because Laura's hair is a little too short to do some styles. So I'll definitely have a lot of fun playing around with her hair and doing some cute styles. But look at how cute she is. Oh. This is adorable. Her hair turned, Sarah does such a nice rooting job. I'm definitely gonna get some close-ups. Let's see if we can make her stand though. Um, Sarah weighted her legs a lot heavier than her arms and her head, so it'll be easier to stand her. She said it's a little tricky, but like once you get the hang of it, then it's not that bad. Okay, oops. It's definitely gonna take some getting used to. I have to play around with having to balance her and stuff. But, oh, she's such a cutie. All right, I will definitely get some close-ups now so you guys can look at her. Look at how pretty, it's not even showing up at all on camera how pretty she is. That's kind of like close to her actual coloring. She's so pretty. Wow. Look at her. Her hands are so cute. Hopefully she'll be able to like hold some stuff because she has open hands. Oh, these are so cute. Look at how pretty that is. Her coloring is so nice. <laughs> She's such a sweet face. Her head is a lot rounder than I thought it was. <laughs> look at how cute, but look at that rooting. It's so like realistic. Hold on. Look at that, it looks so nice. Her hair looks really real. I love her eyes, they're so pretty. They look kind of dark on camera, but they're really not that dark. It's probably just the lighting. It's kind of gloomy today, it was raining earlier. But she's so, so cute. Oh, and I forgot to mention, her name is Tate. And so, this is my new toddler. I'm so excited to have her, and she's so cute. All right, guys, well, thank you all so much for watching. Please click like and subscribe, and in the comments, let us know if you're excited for more videos with Tate. And we'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye.